This is Heidi from craftivism.com and I'd like to share with you my resistor <laughs> my resistor pattern of hats. So if you are a member of the group March for Science, you might have seen that I posted this hat knit hat design which features a battery here and then three resistors, the symbol for three resistors in series, which is any person who's taken physics know would increase the resistance. So resistors are common in, commonly used in electronics to slow down the current from a source such as a battery or when you plug something into the wall you get a current and if the item, the electronic item that you're trying to power doesn't need that much current, say it might break if you have too much current going through it, you add resistors to slow down the current. And when you diagram out those plans, you diagram it out with, this is the symbol for a battery, this is the symbol for a resistant resistor, and then you have the closed circuit, which means the system is on. This is my first, my original hat. Let's see. So, got a lot of great comments. It's very, very exciting to watch those comments come in. I have a lot of comments on developing a DNA double helix hat. So this was my attempt at that, DNA double helix. And it might not be the most recognizable double helix pattern out there, but it works for me. I quizzed my friend in lab about what it was and he didn't know, but then once I told him, he thought it was obvious. So it might be one of those little inside jokes of a pattern until you explain what it is. And then next, so I designed these for the March for Science and I had several people say it might be too hot or where they live it's too hot for a headband. So I designed these or for a hat. So I designed these headbands that will go, um, they can either go on your head or they can go on a straw brimmed hat. So this one has the resistor pattern. I just made it the teal with the white circuit. I also modified the double helix pattern to not have base pairs. And then I made a double helix pattern with base pairs. So when you're making these, you can keep the stripe or you can make it without the stripe and just have the contrast color be the pattern. I've also started to design with limited race, um, success some armbands or coffee mug cozies. This one has this, the equation for resistance. Resistance equals volts over current. And it has the symbol for resistance, the ohm on the back. So stay tuned for this pattern. I will be posting it soon. I also have just a simple mug cozy or arm warmer that I made and I might embellish it with it with fabric paints or embroidery. And I have this, I attempted to do color work and get a resistor pattern down to the scale of an armband. It wasn't quite so successful so I have the battery on and then I had to make my resistor smaller so I only have two peaks and two troughs for the resistor symbol, but it's not terrible. It's, it'll do. I'm not ter it's not a complete failure, but not as great as I was hoping for. It doesn't show up as well as the hat. But anyway, those are some other options. And stay tuned for more tutorials on how to knit and how to make these awesome items. And I hope to see you at the much.